Hi, do you need a Philips Hue bridge to work with Philips Hue strip lights and Philips Hue bulbs when working with Alexa? I will show you in this video what I found out. In this video I'm going to talk to you about the Philips Hue strip light and also the Philips Hue bulbs. Do I need a Philips Hue bridge for them to work? Do they work with Amazon Echoes? Watch this video and I'll show you more. I've often gone into shops and I've asked questions to do with, does this work with Amazon Echoes? Does it work with Alexa? Uh, how does it work? Do I need a bridge? Will it work straight in? And I've often had information given to me which I found not to be correct. So in this video, I'm gonna to talk to you about what I found and hopefully it'll help you in your purchases. Right, first off, I have a, an Amazon Echo Plus. If you don't know about the Amazon Echoes, I've got a, another video that I've posted which talks about the Echo Dot, the Echo and the Echo Plus. Please uh, visit that. If these are the sort of technology videos you like and also if you like things to do with car technology, automation, uh, equipment that you have in cars, road tests and how to repair the videos, please like and subscribe to my channel. I'll try and post on a, on a weekly basis. Anyway, let's get in back into this video. I have bought a Philips Hue light strip. I've often gone into an electrical shop and asked, do these Philips Hue lights work with an uh, Amazon Echo Plus? And usually I've got the question back, if I want this light to work, I need an, um, a Philips Hue bridge. Now, to get the best out of the lights, I still probably think that you need a Philips Hue bridge to give you all the colors that are available. But these lights, the Philips Hue bulbs and the Philips Hue light strip, work straight from the app on Alexa. As usual, all links to all items are in the description below. Now let's jump into a quick demonstration of what they can actually do. All right, first off, I'll just show you the Philips Hue bulb. Alexa, turn on lounge light. Okay. Alexa, turn lounge light to 50%. Okay. Alexa, turn lounge light to 10%. Okay. Alexa, lounge light off. Okay. So what I found is that they do work and they work through the Alexa app where you can change the colors and you can ask Alexa to change the, to turn the lights on and off. They will dim. Um, I do think that if you have the Philips Hue bridge that you have a bit more control over them. You, for example, you can use the Philips Hue app which you can't actually use on um, if you don't have the Hue bridge. Right, now let's go on to the Philips Hue light strip. Now these have 3M sticky backing. I haven't actually put this in place, so I thought I'd demonstrate it to yourself. Now I've named this because I've got more lights, I've named this my sixth light. You can give it whatever name you want to. So let's, as same as with the lounge lights, you can change the, the name that you want for the lounge lights. Um, the lounge lights and, and that you can also work when you're out of the house as well, using your iPhone app. I presume it works with Android, although I haven't got an Android, so I can't, can't confirm that to yourself. Alexa, turn on the sixth light. Okay. So as you can see, the light is on. Alexa, dim the sixth light to 50%. Okay. Alexa, change the sixth light to white. Okay. Alexa, change the sixth light to cool white. Okay. Alexa, change the sixth light to yellow. Okay. Alexa, change the sixth light to blue. Okay. Alexa, 
change the six light to purple. Okay. Alexa, turn the sixth light to 100%. Okay. So as you can see, you, you have the control verbally of what you can control through Alexa. You also have the, the app that I have on your iPhone. Um, where I just, I'm just gonna put it onto soft white. There we go, soft white. And we can also change the uh, brightness of the light with the iPhone app, as well as actually speaking. Now all this is working through the Echo Plus. Now the Echo Plus will also work through TP-Link to turn uh, other lights on that you have plugged in straight away into the plug socket so you can control these all together. You can set routines where you can um, say turn on the lounge and every light and every plug that you have on will turn on or turn off that you set as a group of the lounge. So there we have it. You do not need a Hue bridge to work the Philips Hue lights if you've got an Echo Plus. I hope this helps you. It was a question that I ask quite often. Please like, subscribe and comment if you have any questions and uh, I'll try and answer those to you. Um, I'll try and post videos on a weekly basis, um, some technology, some more automotive. Uh, if these are the things that appeal to you, please like and subscribe to my channel. If you need more information about the other Echoes, I've posted another video. Please uh, watch that one. As usual, in the description, I have posted links to all the items tested here. Uh, the, all these items have been purchased by myself. I'm I've done this video to help you in the way that I couldn't find the questions when I was actually asking them myself. Uh, Amazon, I always find, isn't the best at description, so I hope this helps. And thanks for watching. Please check out my other videos on the Amazon Echoes if you want to know the difference between the Echo Dot, the Echo, and the Echo Plus.